everyone, it's Nona Grace, and I'm from Western New York. Yesterday, I thought that Mr. Brown was broody. Well, Mr. Brown apparently wasn't broody because I did let her out of the cage this morning, and she hasn't been in the nesting box at all. She didn't even lay an egg today, so I'm sure she's not broody. Even though she did lay an egg in the in the cage overnight, she did lay an egg. So she must have been trying to lay that egg. That's why she was so long in that box. I don't know. But she's not broody today. So, But she does. Jim said that she bites at his feet really hard when he walks through the room. Not only does she growl at him, she, he bites at her. Bites at him. Whereas she just follows me around. Like when I'm cleaning up the poop, she will come and she'll tap on the little dustpan that I use. And when I use the mop, she always has to hop on top of the mop. And as I'm mopping the floor, she's mopping with her feet, trying to help me, I think. I'm not sure. And I say when I'm all done, she gets off, and I put the mop away. Funny little bird. I've been watching. Now, this is something that I really, really plan to hope to do this year. It's, it's something that I know we all need to do, probably, is get rid of some stuff. I have a room that I want to just empty out to the to the bare bones. I'll just leave what's actually supposed to stay in there and everything else. I want what I want to do. In fact, I told Jim I wanted to take it all outside on a day that it's really really nice and have a tarp on the ground, and then have um, a sign. My sign that says sale, and then have people have a a jar that they just will donation, a donation jar, so they could take whatever they want. If they want to put some money in the donation jar, they put some money in. If they don't, then they don't. And what they think it's valued at, that's what they would uh, put in there. If they think it's not worth much, then that's what they put in there. Because I really need to hoe out. I've been looking for a jump rope. I did find the one jump rope. I found the two-handled jump rope, the one that... If, two person. Or two well, it's actually three people because yeah. two would hold it and one would skip. I found that one and I've been looking for my other one. It's got ball bearings in the handle. It's a really nice jump rope. Haven't found that. that and that tells me that there's so much stuff in this house that who knows where it is. And who used it last? I don't know. And I haven't found my earphones yet either. That's a, that is a real mystery because those I always put away. So I don't know where those are, but I'm hoping I find them in the room that they're supposed to be in. I'm hoping, because that's the room they should be in if they're anywhere. I usually take them off and I put them right back. In fact, I had just changed the ear, ear things on it to make it a little smaller for the earbuds, because I felt they were a little big. And I put it back, but it's not there still, so time will tell. If I ever find it, I'll let you know. So have a great night, and I'll talk to you all again tomorrow. Bye. It's kind of.